Stan Gibalisco here uh, on vacation on one of the four moons of Saturn depicted in this illustration. Either this one, this one, this big one in the foreground, or that one. I will not disclose which one lest you come after me for making such a bad video. But what I'd like to do is show you basically two different types of oscilloscope display or uh, dual axis display that you'll find in hobby electronics and all the way up through engineering. This is a conventional oscilloscope display which shows amplitude on a vertical axis like that and time on a horizontal axis like that. Time generally proceeds from past to present to future towards the right. Positive amplitude goes up negative amplitude goes down and of course when you put a signal into such a thing you get a waveform display and in this case it's a sine wave such as you might get if you listen to a pure radio frequency unmodulated carrier signal that's what you would see if you adjusted the parameters of the oscilloscope correctly so it is what they call a time domain display because the x-axis or horizontal axis portrays time. The other type of display that you'll find is called a frequency domain display because on the horizontal axis you see frequency rather than time. The frequency that your radio is tuned at or that you uh, consider the center of your display is right there uh, in the middle and then going up is the amplitude axis all the way actually from zero to some maximum and there's of course a limit to how sensitive the reception can be based on the level of noise coming in on your radio signals appear as vertical pips the stronger the signal the taller the pip and it's that simple that is called a spectrum analyzer display so those are the two types of display to look for uh, if you're just starting out in electronics, uh, the time domain display, which is what an oscilloscope conventionally will use, and the frequency domain display, which typically is used by a spectrum analyzer, both lab instruments that you will eventually want to have. Whether or not you can afford the place I'm doing this video from is another story entirely. And of course, it's delayed in time because of the propagation of the radio waves that convey the signal that have this video on it uh, from Saturn to Earth. Stanja Belisco signing off. Until next time, so long.